Right, as you can see, this uh, thermojet I built is based around a YS Tech TMD fan, which came out of my computer heat sink. And the combustion chamber part was built out of a pair of soup cans. Basically, uh, I attached two soup cans together with duct tape originally, but the duct tape would melt whenever the system heated up, so I ended up wedging everything together between some bricks. Here's a look inside, and I don't think you could see it that well, but there are some holes drilled in the back of this can to let air through, and this other can is where the combustion takes place. This can on the front is just an air duct leading from the fan into the actual combustion chamber. I originally had the fan attached directly there, but what would happen was that part would get very hot while it was running, and the tape would either melt off or I would melt one of my computer fans. All right, to power the fan, I'm using a computer power supply plugged into that GFCI outlet right outside and uh, I jumpered the motherboard connector so that it would come on when I flipped the switch on the back. For fuel I'm using paint thinner and a paper towel stuffed into the combustion section and this is what I'm gonna light it with and that's pretty much it. I think I'll go for a start right now.